Previously on This Week in Corners Kids. Mason wants to be a part of this so bad. He can still see you in the mirror, bro. <laughs> Hey Corners kids and parents, my name's Mama Jones and I'm your kids ministry director here at the Corners Chapel. We are so excited about this coming Sunday and we just want to give you an overview of this week's lesson. We have so many amazing people that serve in our Corners kids ministry. Here's one of them, so take it away. Okay Mason, this is your chance. They didn't let you in the video last week and that's fine, but now this is your opportunity, your shot, your destiny make the best Corners Kids video ever seen. You got this. Don't mess it up. I won't mess it up. I won't mess it up. Okay. Okay. Action. Hey, boys and girls at the Corners Kids. My name is Mr. Mason, and I teach in the Transformers class at the Corners Kids. And we here at the Corners Kids Ministry are looking forward to seeing you. We've got lots of great things coming up for each of the classes. I wanna give you a little sneak preview of what we're gonna talk about. But before we talk about what's coming up, I wanna remind you of things we learned last week. We learned that when we live our lives totally for Him, that is our act of worship. Everything we think, everything we say, everything we do. And guess what? You know that this next Sunday is our second Sunday in our new series on worship. We will continue to learn about being a living sacrifice to God and living our lives totally for Him, which is our act of worship. You wanna hear something really cool? Well, last week I got to worship God by teaching you guys in Corners Kids. And it's so much fun. I had a great time being there. But this week, I get to worship God by playing my guitar on the worship team. Maybe I need to practice a little more. I don't just worship God on Sunday on the worship team. As a believer, I worship God with my whole life. At work, one way I worship God is I listen to my coworkers when they're having a bad day. At home, one way I worship God is help my wife with the dishes. And in my community, one way I worship God is mowing my neighbor's lawn even when they don't ask. Take some time to talk to your parents and talk about the ways you already worship God. Remember, worship is to honor with extravagant love and extreme submission or, as the preschoolers learned it, it's to love God and obey Him. This week will be another week of great learning about worship. You'll have a jump start on it because you'll find out how to worship God. Here are a couple things you can do to get ready for classes. Number one, read or have read to you Romans 12, 3. Why? Because that's the Bible passage you will learn about. And hey, guess what? Your family will be hearing about some, if not all, of those verses too. Number two, be working on memorizing Romans 12, 1 through 2. And guess what? Your family will have been challenged to memorize those verses too. And number three, we have a new catechism question. It is question number 14, which says, did God create us unable to keep his law? Well, guess what? That is a great question. And Mrs. Ariana and I are going to have to talk about that at our dinner table. Wait, why did I mention her? She's not in this episode. This is my episode, my time to shine. Uh, can you rewind and, and erase that part? I don't want to, this is my episode. Catechism question. It is question number 14, which says, did God create us unable to keep his law? Well, guess what? That is a great question. And I will have to think about that all by myself at the dinner table. So those are just a few things you can do to get ready for Sunday classes. But now there will be teaching time, object lessons, crafts, and games. And when you get back in your car to go home, 
you will have lots of things to share with your whole family. For you preschoolers, you will have some new songs as well. It's gonna be great. Here at the Corners Kids Ministry, we look forward to seeing you Sunday. And thanks for listening to This Week in Corners Kids. I think that was pretty good. Maybe. That was, maybe. <laughs>